An electrician's manual. Wonder what that's doing here. Interesting. Looks like I need to put in a password. Take your forks and a crank to the BDI's ranch and make sure you see what's below. When you stick the forks in and give it a spin, off toward my treasure you'll go. Looks like someone's been hanging out in here. What a beautiful horse! If I ask, maybe Mary will let me borrow these. That wasn't there before. Hi, can I help you with something? Is that you riding that beautiful Palomino in the picture over there? That's my horse, Banner. I train him myself. What else can he do? Anything I ask. He and I are both pretty talented. That's a pretty big hunk of petrified wood over there. Where'd you get it? A friend of mine found it when he was clearing land for a new house. I told him I'd share whatever I got for it with him. Be sure to check out the jewelry display. I just got some real nice pieces in. I noticed some tuning forks over there. Would it be okay if I borrowed them for a while? Tell you what, if you go out and find me 10 arrowheads for this display I'm working on, I'll give them to you for free. You can put them in this. I already have 10 arrowheads, see? So you do. It looks like I only need 9 to finish this display. So here, keep this arrowhead. Thanks for your help, Nancy. Those tuning forks are all yours. It was great talking to you. Come in again. I bet Dirk custom made this, which means I better not go messing around in there. The shape of this box looks familiar. This outline reminds me of something.
Now go and peek beneath zebra rock, and a tractor of metal what's there will unlock. I'm getting that definite feeling I'm not alone. Looks like Mary Yazzie and Tex? said to wear gloves. Tex must have turned the horses out for the night. goes here. This goes here. That looks right. looks right. That looks right. looks right. There. Sorry, coyotes. No chicken dinner for you tonight. Oh my gosh. My gloves. They're glowing. That powder in the ghost town. Again? Was anything sabotaged? The power lines going to the ranch house were either cut or were otherwise disconnected from the house. You mean you don't have electricity? We have a generator. It's pretty noisy, but it sure beats the alternative. But listen to this. When I was exploring the ghost town, I got this powdery stuff all over my gloves. And last night, when it was dark, my gloves were glowing. Glowing? Like the horse? Exactly like the horse. Maybe it glows because someone rubbed some kind of phosphorescent powder all over it. And if you found that stuff in the ghost town, that must be where he or she has been hanging out. Which is why I think I'll go back out there first chance I get. And another thing, Dave was suspiciously absent during all the excitement last night. You better be careful, Nancy. If he and whoever's out at the ghost town are working together, they may decide you're a threat. I'll be okay. I'm more worried about you guys. Well, the fog has finally lifted, and they say we will definitely get out of here today. What they won't say is when. That's it for now. Two words, Nancy. Call, Call us! us.